That moment I was dreaming. I knew it instantly, even though it was summer break. I was in a hallway at my school, and I had a knife in my right hand for some reason. A knife? I don't understand. I guess all dreams are like this. Help. Huh? Uh. She was my classmate. Oh, Takara is my name. Anyways, Kayama-san was afraid of something. <laughs> Someone's attacking her. I soon realized the plot of this dream. I use this knife to defeat the bad guy and save Kayama-san, and then I become the hero. All right. Kayama-san, I'm coming! Huh? Uh, it was not human. Kayama-san's neck was stretched abnormally. It was trying to rip her head off. I immediately became scared, and my desire to fight faded away. It doesn't matter, right? It's just a dream. Right. No? Then what? Hey, Oni-chan. That was pretty loud. Did you have a nightmare or something? Oh. M Mina. You're in high school now. Yeah, I'm fine. It's nothing. That afternoon I realized the repercussions of my dream. Yes. Hello? What? Kayama-san hung herself in her room. She apparently died without leaving any last words behind. There was no real reason at all. Did my dream show me the future? Or did Kayama-san die because she was killed by that monster? <sighs> then, if I had saved her in my dream, maybe she... N no. That's just stupid. This is pure coincidence. After that, I never had that horrifying dream again. See? It was just a coincidence. But then, a week later... <laughs> I see it again. It hurts. Holding my little sister. Oh, need you. Help me. Uh, uh? Uh, uh. I have to do it. I must save her. Ah! Hey, Mina? Yes. It's open. Mina! I heard my sister's voice just now. A delusion, huh? She's dead. That monster killed her. I thought about killing myself as well, but I didn't in order to seek revenge. But I never saw it again. Has it truly disappeared from my dreams? If it's a monster that kills people in dreams that are not their own, then maybe it's lurking in someone else's dream right this very moment. <laughs>